Uh, I do a radio show called Power Tools. It's on Power 106 in LA here. And we have great guest DJs. I mean, from Afrojack to Tiesto to Hard Rock Sofa to Data Life. I mean, Laid Back Luke, everybody, everybody does the show. Uh, I have a record label called Soulmatic uh, that I do with David Garcia. And uh, my first single that I ever put out was by a group called The Movement, and the song was called Jump. And uh, it was like a big techno record. That went platinum. Uh, just recently, I did a song with Static Revenger and Luciana. I like that. That went uh, double platinum in Australia. And then I had another song that I produced called Galaxy uh, that went platinum in Australia. That was more of a, a pop thing. It was just, uh, I just produced it. My name wasn't on it. Uh, what's cool is about the Integra, um, what I really like about it is that I can get a lot of answers for what I'm looking for in my head. And a lot of times, you know, I'm like, I want that Juno bass, I'm, you know, so I'm going through another sound module trying to figure out what that bass is in my head. And, and having the Integra 7, I think is gonna make things really, really cool and, and help the workflow you know, work faster. And also by having access off the iPad and working from the iPad just makes it a little cooler than having to sit in front of it and press the buttons. Just like touch here, press here, touch there. As opposed to you gotta go into different types of pages. It's a little more uh, cumbersome with an actual module, I think, but with an iPad, it just, you know, it makes it, for some reason, it makes it funner. I think, I think the Integra 7 is going to be used by a lot of different people from, you know, studio rats like myself uh, to live musicians who go on the road. I mean, I could see every band wanting to have access to all these different synths and stuff when you're on the road. I mean, you'd, I couldn't even, I don't even know what you would have to take to bring what's in that box on the road. I mean, you'd probably have to bring 20 different synthesizers. I mean, I couldn't even, I couldn't even imagine that. And, and the access that you have on that for, for live. And then in studio, I think uh, songwriters too, who just, you know, who, who may not even be a producer, but they just want access to a lot of different sounds, very simple. Your brass sounds, to your synth sounds, to, you know, live piano sounds. I mean, it's just, it's just amazing. And a lot of new sounds, which is really cool. One other cool thing that I think is dope about the Integra 7 is the history of sounds that it has. Uh, especially a lot of the old drum sounds that I'm that I'm always in search for for the ring shot and the history of all their synths from you know old Junos on down. I mean, it's just pretty amazing and cool to have all that at your fingertips. <laughs> The Integra 7, which, which is really cool about it, is that it has, it's an JP80, it also has every SRX board. It's like your best sound modules of the past all in one. <laughs> 